Finally tonight, of the 5 million Americans living with Alzheimer's disease, about 60% of them wander off at some point. A problem that inspired one teenager to find a solution that's now getting a lot of attention. Here's NBC's Joe Fryer. Every day, Kenneth Shinazuka makes new memories with a grandfather whose old memories are vanishing. <laughs> Kenneth sings to him the same song his grandpa Deming once taught him. What's it like living with your grandfather when he has Alzheimer's? It, it's definitely very hard. Um, my grandfather uh, has lost the capability to eat by himself, to walk by himself. The first hint of Alzheimer's surfaced when Kenneth was four years old. Within a few years, his grandpa started wandering at night once onto the freeway. We were woken up by a police officer knocking on the door. It was, yeah, very real and very scary. Unable to find a device that quickly detects wandering, this curious teenager decided to make his own. He wants to help people. Uh, he wants to solve problems for people. <laughs> his invention is a sensor, apply pressure, and it immediately triggers an alarm on a smartphone. I mean, that was instant, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Kenneth got an internship with Jim McAleer at the Alzheimer's right. Association. He suggested putting the sensor on a sock so it would go off the moment a patient's foot touched the ground. Pretty incredible for a sock, even more incredible for a sock invented by a 15-year-old. Now Kenneth is testing his technology at a group of assisted living homes called Irvine Cottages. You've actually been helping us a lot with the device. Ida is one of the patients wearing Kenneth's socks at night. So far, no false alarms. The sensor's discreet, and the tracking is accurate, and it goes to a smartphone, so it's a win-win for all of us. Already, Kenneth's invention has earned the Science in Action Award from Scientific American magazine, an invention that could someday help millions, inspired by one young man's love for his grandfather. Joe Fryer, NBC News, Newport Coast, California.